Hey, what is up? Tom Mills here. Uh, I've been playing Pathfinder now for about a year. Uh, my character's name is Baltair Bloodtrack. He's Dwarf Fighter. Look at him. All right, there, that's Baltair. You see him? Well, it's not Baltair. Baltair uses a Warhammer. When I made him, I'm still really new to the game. So, uh, he was my second character, my first character. Long story, he was a barbarian, chaotic evil. Don't do chaotic evil. Just don't do it. It's bad. 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 So I got Baltair Bloodtrack. Uh, he's a uh, dwarf. Just gonna give you a little uh, background on Baltair. Uh, Baltair, simple dwarf, came from a mining family, taught how to fight, uh, went through, he was in army schools his entire life, he grew up in Denton. Now one day he went just to uh, sell some gems. Pretty common for him just being a miner. He went to sell some gems, got in uh, got in kind of a jam, so to say, met, met some people, uh, went back to Daglin, Daglin was under uh, a sickness. Alright, so when Baltair found out that Daglin was under sickness, he went all Sherlock Holmes with his party, they were like, we're gonna figure out what's wrong, and uh, you know, long story short, Warhammer! Boom! Warhammer! Tack, tack, tack! Boom, 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 boom! Found out the princess was kind of being a little bitch. She, uh, was poisoning all her people because some dude named Ichimari, still don't even know who he really is to this day, was like, hey, yeah, we need the dwarves dead. So, uh, Baltair thrown in prison for finding this out. When he's in prison, he finds out that his wife and his son were some of the first people to go from the sickness. Boom! Family's dead. Alright, so once Baltair and his party breaks out of prison, they go, they find out the princess, she's already dead. But there was some high mage dude who was pulling strings even more than she was. So we go, we attack, we uh, we saved Aglet. Woo! We all get these honors, these special honors. Uh, we had an elf ranger, he got his special bow. We had a bard, he got a loot that was also a blunderbuss. He, oh, he actually could do some damage for once, nothing against bards. They are very, very, very useful, especially when you're under illusion, if uh, you know what I mean. Now, uh... Baltair got told that he is now the leader of the Thunderclad. So you don't know who the Thunderclad is? Well, that's probably because in real life they don't exist. Uh, at this point, Baltair is under blood magic. I still not 100% clear in my head, even in real life, know what's had so far has been real and unreal since the beginning of this journey. I found out about this uh, blood magic about a month ago. But, off subject. Baltair now thinks he is leader of the Thunderclot! Todor, the deity, is going to give him electrical powers. He was Todor's main dwarf. You know. So, uh, he was leader of the Thunderclot. He was going all around the world telling people he was leader of the Thunderclot for about seven, eight months. Then I found out that uh, Baltair had been under blood magic since the like second night I'd ever played. He was actually talking about uh, things that weren't existing, and he was hearing what he wanted to hear, and everyone just thought he was insane. Which, it was pretty easy because he had really, really low intelligence. I'm talking dumb. Real dumb. Alright, so... I'm just trying to get you guys caught up to on Baltair's life. Bal I'm going to keep trying to do these videos because Baltair's dumb intelligence that I told you about gets him into awful situations. Hilarious situations, but terrifying for me trying to keep a level 11 dwarf fighter who's practically mentally retarded alive. Very easy to manipulate. So, I will keep you guys up to date. Uh, if you like the video, hit subscribe. You know, all that normal jazz. Alright, I'll talk to you guys on the flip side.